First off, make sure you have a compatible keyboard and mouse connected to your console or PC. For consoles, you might need an adapter to ensure they work correctly. Once you've got your keyboard and mouse hooked up, let's move on to setting up the game. In the main menu of Modern Warfare 3, navigate to the Multiplayer or Spec Ops section, depending on which mode you want to play. Now, you'll need to sign in as Player 2. Grab your controller and press X, if you're on PlayStation, or A, if you're on Xbox, to join the game. With both players signed in, go ahead and set up your match or mission. Before you start, make sure that Player 2's input device is set to keyboard and mouse in the game settings, if available. If you're playing on PC and the game doesn't natively support keyboard and mouse for Player 2, you may need to use third-party software to emulate a controller input for the keyboard and mouse. Be sure to check the game's end-user license agreement to ensure that this is allowed. Playing split-screen with a keyboard and mouse as Player 2 can take a bit of getting used to, especially on a shared screen, but it's a great way to enjoy the game with friends who prefer different control methods. And that's all there is to it. You're now ready to enjoy some epic split-screen battles in COD MW3. If this guide helped you out, don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe for more gaming tips and tricks. Got any questions or suggestions for future videos? Drop a comment below. Thanks for tuning in, and I'll see you on the next battlefield. Game on.